Hello Internet, just a quick video, quick tip for you. If your DJI goggles uh, stop working, if the fan stops working, uh, I just had this happen to me. My goggles are about two years old, maybe a bit more, two and a half years old. And they just started to power off. They would like, I would be flying and after about a minute, two minutes, three minutes, I would just get like the black screen and then the DJI logo, it would reboot and then it would work again for about a minute and then it would reboot again and each time it got shorter and shorter as it got hotter and hotter and eventually to the point where it would just, you know, it's unflyable. Um, and I thought I was gonna have to send the goggles off at DJI, so um, I just took the lid off and found that all I had to do was agitate the fan and it started spinning again. So I don't know if it just got jammed with a bit of dirt or like, um, maybe the pressure of the case flexing had put a bit of pressure on the on the fan hub and once i like loosened it up and took the case apart it just started to spin um, but i'll link down below to a great teardown video that helped me get this far it's pretty simple all you need is a small screwdriver and a little bit of patience it took me about half an hour to take it apart and you can save yourself a trip to dji support so i'll show you inside Okay, so this is what it looks like once you've taken the, the lid off here. Um, it's not that difficult to get into. You just have to be careful and have the right tools. Um, I got this uh, screwdriver set from Bunnings, Kin Chrome uh, Precision Screwdriver Set. I think this is a 1.0. This is the main tool that you need. I uh, know it's a number zero size Phillips head. This will do pretty much anything. As long as you have a Phillips head with a fairly long uh, shaft like this because it needs to be able to get quite deep into the uh, screw holes. Um, that's really all you need to take this apart. It takes about half an hour. And then uh, this is a little fan here. And I'm pretty sure this fan is held in place just with a friction fit because it looks like there's a size difference between the fan and this unit. There's like a lip there. Uh, and I think it's just kind of pushed on to this section and then held with a bit of tape. And uh, in my case, all I had to do really was just agitate the fan blades very gently so that, you know, I just kind of wiggled them back and forth like this and then um, applied power. One thing I did notice is that while it was powered on, if I agitated this, it didn't seem to start. But once I kind of gave it a wiggle and gave it a turn a few times and then powered it on, then it would fire up again. So I don't really know what it was that was causing it to not start up. I mean, I thought maybe it was this cross beam putting pressure on uh, the fan, but I can't seem to replicate that. Like if I put pressure on here, it doesn't stop the fan. And I, I've tried flexing the fan and it doesn't seem to stop it. So um, it could have just been a bit of dirt or something, maybe like a small rock was in there. I don't really know, but giving it a wiggle and you know, I've, I've power cycled it now like 10 or 15 times and every time it spins up now. And before that, I power cycled it about 15 times and it didn't power up. I also wiggled this cable. I don't think that did anything, but, um, you know, I did agitate that while I was kind of messing around in here. So one of these two things could have been the fix. Um, maybe that will help you. Uh, I don't know. Um, I tried to figure out what kind of model of fan this is and I couldn't, and there's no, there's no label on here. Um, I think the label's on the other side, but... Unfortunately, you know, mine's working now, so I'm not going to try and take it apart any further to figure out what that is. Um, so hopefully this helps you if you have a, a simple problem. You'll be able to tell if you have this problem because um, the goggles will boot loop. Um, and also you won't hear the fan sound when you power it on, that kind of whooshing fan sound. Uh, which sounds like this, he said, trying to plug things in with one hand. Oh, there you go. If you can't hear that when you power on your goggles, then uh, you might have this fan problem. So, hope that helps someone. Have a good one. Bye.